Hey guys, it's Liz of Crafty Inked Girl. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here. As you can see, I have another haul for you. I just can't stop myself from shopping. Don't judge, but since there is a lot here, we're just gonna get right into it, so stay tuned. This shop is Sadie Stickers, and I am so excited to have something other than a $2 Tuesday order to show you guys. I went ahead and placed a nice order with her during her anniversary sale a few weeks ago, and this is everything. I will get right into it. I'm going to show you the kits and the freebies first. So my order came with this silver foiled bow header freebie on clear paper. This is a PR freebie from Katie. I put her name in the notes to seller for her sheet. I normally use Taylor from Tattoo Teacher Plans, but I wanted something different because this one is rose gold on clear paper. You could not combine discount codes, but you still could get a PR freebie if you added that in the notes. This is silver foil on a kind of pastel -y, marbly looking background, some larger and smaller bow dots, as well as corner deco stickers. And then last, this freebie is silver foil on clear paper, and this is a collab with Letters to Apollo, some date squares, a few scripts, and some accent divider kind of pieces. Super pretty. She released five new kits during the sale and I picked up three of them. This one is called Moments. It is rose gold foiled and it is beautiful. I normally don't go with like full photo kind of kits, but this one was just so pretty with these sea foamy green colors and the neutral sandy tan colors. And I thought it would be great for the summertime. And I just love that this box here says cherish every moment because right now I feel like that's what we have to do. The second page of the kit has some half boxes, bow checklist stickers, Monday through Sunday box, appointment flags, quarter boxes, build you stickers, and habit trackers. It is the one non-foiled page of the kit. This page is so gorgeous. It is all foil. We have headers at the top and the headers have some bows in the foils and I think that is so pretty and it's the reason why for once I did not add on the extra bow headers because I forget to use these and they're just so gorgeous. These have the bow checklist flags, some layering pieces with hexagons, arrows, flags, and more appointment labels, and a couple of foiled half boxes and quarter boxes down there. And this page with the stunning bottom washi. This design is really what sold me on this kit. I have never seen anything like it before. It is so different and unique and I love it. And I really like that the same design is on the date covers. And then you have a few more quarter boxes and some more header or just washi strips, however you want to use them. So that is the Moments kit. <clears throat> this kit is called La Creme and it is gold foiled. I am a dessert junkie. I love cupcakes and cake and pastries. So when I saw this one, it really, really spoke to me. And I love the teacups because I do love tea as well. And this box here that says eat dessert first made me think of my grandmother because she would always nibble at dessert while she was making dinner. And because of that, I just had to have it. The format is the same. So I will just flip through so you can see all these pretty colors. These rosy pink tones with the mint are just gorgeous and I love all of that foil. And this really pretty bottom washi with the cupcakes. I want to eat them. They are so sweet looking. So that is La Creme. 
So last but not least is the fourth kit and I am so excited to use this kit. I'm a big 4th of July person. I love all things patriotic. I love red, white, and blue. And when I saw this kit out of all the other 4th of July themed ones, I had to have it because of the ice cream, the cupcake, that really beautiful flag bow, and then add to it that it is pixie dust hollow foil. Oh my God, I love hollow and that just takes it to the next level. If you saw my last haul, you saw that I got these Pixie Dust Hollow page toppers from Planner Pixie Co. And this is the kit that I had in mind to use it with because 4th of July, fireworks, sparkles, let's make the kit as sparkly as possible. So I will flip through to this bright, happy kit. And oh my God, look at that foil. I, I'm i just in love and I wanna see that in the sunlight. I love this bottom washi with the flag bows and the fireworks. It is just awesome. Okay, so those are the kit new releases. Now I'll go into the albums. So first I got her mini album. This is a, not a new release, but I decided now would be a good time to pick it up while it's 30% off. I got this celestial theme with the hollow foil and I absolutely love it. This is the perfect size album for $2 Tuesday sheets. This one came with a freebie that is hollow foil on the same kind of celestial background and these have 30 sleeves in them so you could fit quite a lot of sheets in there because you could definitely put more than one sheet per sleeve and they're great for all your freebies and like I said all your $2 Tuesday size sheets because I did not have a great way to organize those so I'm really excited for that. The next album I got is the regular size album in the Magical Snacks cover and before we talk about anything else about the album let's just talk about this design. Oh my god, it is so so pretty. I got it with the Pixie Dust Hollow Foil and all of the foiling are little Mickey heads and I am just I'm just in awe of how this cover looks. I want like every sticker in the world in this design. My boyfriend and I have been binge watching Happiest Vlogs on YouTube. They're a couple that take like tons of Disney vacations and they just vlog the whole thing and it is awesome and we're living vicariously through them because we want to be in Disney so, so badly. Okay, I digress, but oh, I will link the happiest vlogs below because like if you're a Disney fanatic, they're just a lot of fun to watch. So this is the regular size album. This was a kind of like, she wanted to put these out to see how they were received because they are a smaller size than what she calls her large album, which I'll pull out for comparison. So this is one of her large albums. They're perfect for sticker kits. Oh, look at that. I actually have a Sadie's kit right there on the front page. So these are great for the kits. And then like this is a great size for like your character sheets and scripts. So like this is a character sheet from Sweet Bean Plans and I will show you how that fits in here. So those fit really nicely. There's still a little bit room at the top so you could put a little bigger sheet in here, but it's definitely too small for like a kit kind of sheet but it is perfect for your characters and your scripts and things of that nature so i think that she may come out with these for like like a regular item in the shop but for now i think they were just for the sale unless she has added them and i just didn't notice but it is perfect i absolutely love it and i love the design so that is everything that I got from Sadie Stickers from this order and you know for sure you will see more from her in the near future because I'm obsessed with her stickers and I can't stop.
this order here is the May subscription from Sweet Bean Plans and the theme is Relax. I took it out of the plastic, but it did come with a sticker with your name on it, which I love. I think that's super cute. And there are a lot of fun things in here. So first we have the washi tape and it is foiled and there are little planners on here, the pillow, a candle, a stack of books with some lavender on it and it is just adorable. We have a little deco sheet here. I absolutely love this cup of tea with lemon and these colors are just so pretty. This comes with four individual sticker sheets. This is one of the coffee trays in the relax theme and we have that little mug on it that says breathe and there's lavender on there, a candle, a pillow, the lemons and it's just so so cute the little mugs that say calm with the lavender and here we have bean bean doing a face mask and bean with a robe on and a book getting ready to take a bath at least that is what i'm imagining bean doing and then some flat lace stickers that are just so pretty we have a little package of a die cuts and in here we have the stack of books with the lavender that oops that coffee tray the pillow and the mug with the lavender adorable and now let's get into the kit. So on the first page, we have nine full boxes and these colors are just so beautiful. I love them. We have Bean here saying relaxed, refreshed, and recharged. And down here, it's okay to take a break. And I think that is something that a lot of us struggle with. We do not give ourselves enough break and we do not give ourselves enough self-care. So I need to work on that personally. We have the checklist boxes and the Monday through Sunday box and some checklist flags at the bottom. This washi is so pretty. I love that marbled look with the crystals on it. It's just so simple and it's gonna make the spread look so clean. Date covers and glitter headers. All of your script headers, your binge watch and currently reading box, habit trackers, icons, dinners, TV, and other functional stickers there. All of your half boxes, quarter boxes, and third boxes, your weekend banner, and a couple of flags. And that is it. This kit is so, so sweet. I am so excited that I signed up for her subscription and I cannot wait for the next one. So that is Sweet Bean Plans. This order here is from Scribble Prince Co. And it came with a couple of freebies. We have the character sheet here on clear paper with hollow foil. And this journaling card with silver foil. It's a little bit of a wintry looking theme. So I will save that for later this year. I went ahead and picked up one ultimate kit and a couple of other accessories. This is the Munchkin Head freebie that comes with the kit, which is a collab with Once More With Love. And this is the Summer and Nights kit, and it is so gorgeous. I absolutely fell in love when I saw these colors because I am a purple girl. That sky in the double box, oh my god, that is a beautiful, beautiful sunset and I wish I was there right now. So these are the eight full boxes on the main page. This page came with two additional full boxes and that is actually the reason why I went with the ultimate kit because I love this box with the ice cream. It looks so yummy and I want to have it so badly. We have our half boxes, these square boxes, which I really, really like and your heart checklist boxes, which I never really use. 
this page has the gorgeous deco on there and this really, really pretty weekend script. I love this movie marquee and then you have other functional pieces and some other boxes and flags. We have the heart checklist flags, habit trackers, layering flags, icons, some shorter checklist boxes, and your Monday through Sunday boxes. These kits come jam-packed with so much, I feel like you could stretch them out over two weeks if you're a white space planner. I love all of these half boxes and quarter boxes, the appointment labels and bill due stickers. This cut washi up top, those colors are just stunning. Love that. The script headers and your other circle icons here. Some plain cut washi and other functional stickers on that page. And then we have this beautiful bottom washi. I absolutely love that purple ocean crashing onto the beach and those date covers. So that is the ultimate kit. And then I went ahead and I added on the fashion girl sheet because I really wanted to use this girl here with the ombre hair that matches everything in the kit. And then the glitter headers because I am a sucker for the glitter headers. And I got a sheet of hollow foiled confetti glitter box overlays. I know it's really hard to see because the hollow is, or really the foil is really, really fine on these, but because these are not foiled, I wanted to just add a little bit of something extra to that. And then I also got the glitter headers and this 15 millimeter washi strip that matches the summer moon kit. I did not order the summer moon kit from Scribble Prints because I ordered it from Planner Pixie Co. And I am going to go ahead and use those with her kit. I will show you that coming up in just a moment and show you why I got these to go with the other kit. But that is everything from Scribble Prints Co. And I am so excited to use this kit. This is my most recent order from Planner Pixie Co. I picked all of this up during the last sale she was part of, and this was the no minimum freebie during the sale in a really cute coffee theme. And then for how much I spent, I got a two page mini kit that has four full boxes with these super cute coffee cats, some heart checklist boxes. And then on this page, we have glitter headers, date covers, and some other functional pieces. I got two kits and some foiled items and let's get right into those. So the first kit I picked up is the Summer Moon kit. These are the glitter headers that came with it. They're very pretty and I will use them for something but I'm just not going to use them for this spread because I want to use the glitter headers I picked up from Scribble Prints Co. There is just something to me about the black in those headers that just makes the colors pop and I think it's going to add something really special to the spread and I cannot wait to use those together. So I am glad that I got those. These full boxes are absolutely gorgeous. I am in love with this girl. The reason I went with Randy's version of the kit over Andrea's is simply because I like this girl's pink and purple hair and Andrea's version had black hair. Otherwise, they are both gorgeous, but that just made this one win out a little bit more. I'm in love with this ice cream cone. Those star sprinkles on there are so cute. I want black ice cream so badly, and I love her black nail polish because I wear black nail polish an awful lot. So those are the full boxes. These are the checklist boxes, and then this is the extra full box, date covers, and the bottom washi, which I got, as you saw before, the strip of ombre washi, and I think that is going to look so nice with the black and white stripes, which I really love. I just wasn't as crazy about that pattern. It's not that it's not nice, but I just like that better. And I feel like this all together, there is just something about how that is going to look that I absolutely love. And I'm kind of happy that I sort of customized everything to the way I like it. 
So let's go through the rest of the kit. We have our half boxes, some quarter boxes and other labels, more half boxes, the weekend banner, habit trackers, some flags and scripts, functional items, cot washi, build you stickers, Monday through Sunday boxes, and then my favorite sheet, the deco pieces. Now, a lot of people don't know this about me, but bats are my favorite creature like in the world. And I love that there are so many bats in this kit. That is the other reason this kit spoke to me so much. And I do have to point out one other thing that I love. In all of the deco pieces that Randy has, she always does a planner on the deco page. And that planner always has a cover that matches the theme of the kit. And I feel like that attention to detail is just so awesome. And it makes it a little extra special. So that is the summer moon kit. The next kit I picked up is the glamping kit. And that came with the glitter headers, of course. And I just really loved the greens in here, these warm yellows in the sky. And that girl is just so, so pretty. It's the same format as the last kit, so I'm just gonna flip through so you can see the colors. They're just soft and pretty, and I think they'll be really, really nice for the summertime. And I don't know if I'm gonna get to do any real summer activities this year. So at least I'll live vicariously through my planner. And then there again are all the pretty deco pieces. And look at the cover on that planner. The detail is just amazing. I absolutely love it. So that is the glamping kit. And now for the foil portion of the order. So I went ahead and ordered some more of her Pixie Dust Underlays. I'm not entirely sure what kits I'm going to use these with yet, but I wanted to add some more sparkle to some of my summer kits. And I got three pages each of the silver foil, the gold foil, and then her silver hollow foil. So her silver hollow is more of a traditional hollow. And I will just show you for comparison because she has another hollow that she calls hollow. And then she calls this one silver hollow. So if you could see what she calls hollow is much more purple toned. And then what she calls silver hollow is what is more traditionally seen as hollow. I love them both, especially because there's so many purples in some of the summer kits I picked up that I will definitely use that one for sure. But I do love my traditional hollow as well. So that is everything I picked up this time around from Planner Pixie Co. And you can be sure that you'll see more in the near future. This shop is Planning World and it is my first time ordering with her. It came with this journaling card that has some gold foil on it that says quarantine and chill and it is super cute. And I went ahead and ordered two kits. I was looking for kits that had really soft colors and some simple artwork on them. And hers definitely fit the bill for that. Her kits don't have names. They just have numbers. This one is B204. And I believe this was a more recent release. This has some silver foil on it and her foil is very subtle and simple and it is just beautiful because it adds a little bit of accent but it's not overwhelming. This pretty box here says enjoy the little things and I absolutely love everything about the eight full boxes on this page. Her paper is a premium matte and it is super smooth and buttery and that is definitely my preferred paper choice. The next page has eight full boxes that do not have heart checklists or anything on them, which I really appreciate because I tend not to use those very often. So it makes these a lot more functional and I really like them. Then we have the foiled 
headers and this foil is so stunning it is super super fine confetti foil and I absolutely love it and then you have these quarter boxes that just have the really simple foiled line on them and they are they're just beautiful I I just I love them on this page we have two foiled habit trackers and two foiled Monday through Sunday boxes and then a few other quarter boxes third boxes and then half boxes with some nice pattern backgrounds and a couple of little images on them that are just not intrusive at all this page has the foiled date covers some cut washi strips here and then your bottom washi which again it's just a very simple subtle design and it is beautiful the last page here has foiled bow dots some checklist flags icons some other flags to layer and of course the deco pieces which if you have watched any of my other hauls you know I am a junkie for the deco pieces. So that is the beautiful B204 kit. The other kit I picked up is kit B152 and this has stunning simple subtle rose gold foil and i am a sucker for rose gold on pink and then add to the fact that this is a coffee themed kit and i absolutely love it this kit is a slightly older format i believe so it is a little bit different but you still have your eight full boxes and then you have these eight full functional boxes. This page has the stunning confetti foiled headers and then some quarter boxes here. We have some more quarter boxes, half boxes with foil, half boxes without foil, and then this is all cut washi down here. This page has the foiled date covers, a habit tracker, some flags, and then your washi. And this washi does not have any foil on it for the bottom. And then this page is different from the other kits. This one comes with the foiled date dots, these flags, and the icons here, and then some other flags and arrows for layering. And last, we have a deco page and an additional full box. Both of these kits are absolutely stunning. I am really excited to use them and I will definitely order from Planning World again. This shop is the Crafty Banana and I am so, so, so excited for what is in this really cute black envelope with the gold heart on it which is her signature and on the back the orders always come with a stamp sticker that has some indication of what kit is in there so if you recognize that you might know but i am so thrilled for the friends kit she calls this one the one with the sticker collection and it is so stinking cute and beautiful and I am just in love with it. Okay, so first I got the mini kit and this is mini kit two. It came with this freebie and her freebies they always have such cute things on them and the attention to the detail on them is just beyond these are her little candles and each one has a friend's reference on it we have central park rachel's trifle monica clean and on a break and then on the tv and the laptop there are scenes from the kit and they're so tiny and so well done and it just makes me really enjoy shopping from 
Brianna because of how detail oriented she is and how creative her artwork is. And this is all hand drawn. So it really makes it super, super special. So into the kit, I went with this one because I loved these boxes up here as well as the scene. I didn't get the full scene kit because they don't come with those boxes, but I may wind up adding that on at some point anyway. But these boxes have the one where they drink coffee, 1994 to 2004 the door from the apartment. I'll be there for you with the couch and the coffee, of course. And now let's get a good look at this scene. I mean, really, there is so much in here. You can look at it for like an hour and find like a new detail. It is just gorgeous. But I went with the mini kit, which is three pages because the deluxe kits have a lot of stuff in them and I don't always use everything. So I got this and then some add-ons that I will show you, but let's look at the rest of the kit. The second page has the deco on it, the Monday through Sunday box, icons, a weekend banner, some flag checklist stickers, a couple of appointment flags, half boxes and quarter boxes in like the rounded style um, on those. And then on the last page, there are some script headers and stickers for like dinners, TV, whatever, a habit tracker, and then your bottom washi, which is just super fun. So that is the kit itself. And then I added on some things to go with it just to round out the kit, which I like because then I really just have what I need and I don't really have a lot to waste. I used Taylor from Tattoo Teacher Plans. I used her PR code and this is her freebie. It is so cute. I love that there are some more candles on there and the coffee cup and that strawberry container is just so, so cute. And again, like the sheet of the coffee cup stickers in a mini sticker, I just, it kills me. I love it. There's just, there's no words for how cute it is. So I added on the date covers and then I added on two additional sheets of half boxes, one in rounded corners and one in square corners. And I added on the glitter sampler with some more quarter boxes, the glitter headers and the half boxes. And I just love how bright and happy these colors are. And I just cannot wait to use this kit and sit and reminisce about like all the funny friends things that I love and my boyfriend loves it too and it just makes it super special. So that is the one with the sticker collection from The Crafty Banana and you should definitely check her out. I have a referral code for her so I will link that down below. This shop is Honey Inked and this is my first order from her. I have actually been eyeing her shop for quite a long time and it was my birthday a couple of weeks ago and I had some extra money so I finally went ahead and placed an order with her. I love this vellum envelope that the order came in and that really really pretty rose sticker that she used to seal it and the order comes with a standard freebie, which is some black icons on clear paper, and they are all super cute and very functional, so I will definitely use that. And I also used Rachel from Gather Plans. I used her PR code and I put her name in the notes to seller so I could get her freebie because I have been dying to try out these half mandalas, but I was never sure if they would take up too much space because I don't always have a lot of white space to fill. And I am really excited to be able to try them out from a freebie. And it comes in a rose gold foil by default, but if you put what color you want in the notes to seller. You could also get it in silver, gold, or just black. And these are all absolutely stunning. So I cannot wait to try that. But what I did go ahead and get were the mini half 
mandalas because I know that I could use these to accent some space and use them with some scripts or other ways just to fill in but not take up a lot of room. So I went ahead and got them in all three foil colors and the detail on these is absolutely spectacular. I am in love with them. So that is the silver, the rose gold, and her rose gold is so nice and pink. It is definitely my preferred tone of rose gold. If you have watched any of my other hauls, you know I've said that before. And then the classic gold, which is a very warm yellow gold. These are just gorgeous and I cannot wait to use them. I also picked up these little tiny stem flowers. These were out of stock for a little while in the foil, all the foil colors, which is another reason I held off on my order for a bit. And I thought these would be a nice way to fill in some space or use them as dividers because I do have a lot of spreads that have floral themes and I just thought something different would be nice. So I got the silver, of course, the rose gold and the classic gold. So those are the tiny stem flowers. And last I got these fancy pen flourishes because I'm running out of some of the ones I have from another shop and I like that there are two designs on here. And again, just a nice way to fill some extra space when accent things and I got silver, rose gold, and classic gold. So that is my order from Honey Inked. I am really, really anxious to get these in my planner and I will definitely be ordering from her again really soon. The shop is Rose Colored Days. This is my first order with her and it came with this clear journaling card that has the month of May on it in hollow foil. Super cute and I will put this on the magnetic board behind my desk. It also came with her business card, which on one side says, think it, want it, get it in rose gold. And on the other side has all of her information. And then this other little freebie, it is two full box overlays in gold, one with the double line and one with their signature bow. So I did not order a lot, but I am actually very excited for what I did get. I have been eyeing these bow accents for so long, but every time I would go to order them, there would be one foil out of stock or another from what I wanted. And finally, all four of them were in stock. So I got them in silver, in rose gold. And her rose gold is definitely kind of a balance between copper and pink. It looks a little bit more copper on the camera, but a little bit more pink in person. It's very pretty. The classic gold, and it looks to me like her classic gold is definitely very yellow and on the hot gold side. I think I might try light gold next time. And then of course, the gorgeous hollow foil. So those are the bow accents. And then I picked up these small bow month scripts, which are a collaboration with Jesenia Printables. I do like to cover up that hexagon in the top left of my spreads in my Erin Condren planner. So I like having a sticker where I can put what month it is. So I got two sheets in each foil color. I got the silver, the rose gold, the classic gold and the gorgeous hollow foil. So that is my order from Rose Color Days. I am very excited to use these and I will definitely order from her again.
This shop is K and Co XOXO, and while it is not stickers, it is still planner related. I placed my order during the Planner Boss Collective sale, and this is my first time shopping with her, and I am very excited. I tried to rewrap it the way that it came because the packaging was just so pretty, and I am a sucker for packaging. We have this really a cute business card right here with her logo and a thank you note on the back with all of her information and then it came with this pretty black bow tied around the polka dot paper and inside we have all of the little goodies that I ordered. So I have been using my petite folio which is purple and I thought that some of these accessories would look super super cute with that. So first I got this gorgeous purple and pink heart with the sparkle in it on a silver clip and then a dangle charm to go with it. I would take these off the backing, but you could actually see the colors better on the white paper than on my hand. So this one has some shimmery beads on it and there are a couple of heart charms in there and it is absolutely beautiful. I got this dangle on gold and this has the star charm on it and a couple of different pink and purple beads also really gorgeous and then i got the two bows they are both on silver one purple and one this really pretty ballet pink with the sequence silver in the middle and i just think these are going to look so pretty on my petite planners and I am really excited to use these and accessorize and I can see why people become junkies for this sort of stuff if they have uh, traveler's notebooks and things like that. So I will definitely order from K and Co XOXO again and in the meantime we'll very much enjoy using these. That is everything I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and hit that subscribe button if you want to see what I have coming up next. I will, of course, link all the shops mentioned in the description below and hope you have a great day. Thanks. Bye.